This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. Tired of missing out on figures or paying scalper prices at toy stores? Then go ahead and visit DJC Collectibles, my sponsor. You can get 10% on anything Transformers, accumulate points, and sometimes score an exclusive figure you thought you'd miss forever. Head over to DJC Collectibles and start saving today. Hi everyone, my name is Raziel Kane. I'm back with another video. And today, again doing a little bit of this because I received these for this fantastic figure. Love gears. Love the way it looks. People complain about the out mode. I don't care. This is my first gears and I love it and it's great. And the toy hack set, it's gonna, you know, again, make him a little more G1. Uh, there's a lot of different Autobot logos, so it's interesting. But this time in advance, I got the cell shaded windows um, sold separately. I'm guessing they're selling it separately because I hear not everybody likes the cell shaded stuff. I love it. So I'm gonna apply all of this to this guy and enjoy uh, the look of this figure, I'm sure. Before I do that, I just wanna remind everyone to check out my voice acting playlist, the main feature of my channel, something I'm very proud of. And now let's roll the intro. And here we have Mr. Grumpy, looking good. I like the uh, silver Autobot logo, nice details, you know, molded details. Um, it's a simple figure uh, with a simple transformation, a bit hollow in the back. Well, not hollow, but I mean, there's, you know, this could have been filled uh, somehow. Um, nice color for the, the windshield, but looking forward to changing that. Nice face sculpt, looks very reminiscent. Actually, he looks more mobile with this head than he did in the show. So, there you go. Uh, nice gun. Again, I doubt that there's going to be something for that, because usually there isn't for guns, but I've been surprised a couple times uh, in the past couple months by Toy Hack, so hopefully I'll be surprised again. Um, so, yeah, fair representation, actually, fair, ex excellent representation of G1 cartoon gre uh, gears. I love this guy. And uh, now we're going to take a look at the decals. Uh, he, you know, you have this, which if I was to Huffer as a similar thing, I think uh, the other one, um, Braun, had that in G12, those uh, M's or W's. And I do believe that they mean something uh, for like the company before Transformer acquired them. But I'm not 100% on what's the name. Go check Rodimus Primal's video. He's going to explain all of that to you. This looks good. I'm not seeing a lot of pin covers. Uh, just eight. Uh, four red, four blue. Uh, there's a lot of little things here. Well, it's, it's like one. I don't know where the, that's going to go. But uh, Gunmetal looks good. License plate. There's uh, gears and HMPH which doesn't remind me anything about Don Messick. So, is there a Messick plate? There's not a Messick plate. Oh man, I would have loved to have that. Humph, oh yeah, I guess that's Humph because he's grumpy. All right, and then here we have, uh, looks to be black windows, uh, which I won't be using. Yeah, that's basically, I'm gonna replace this. So, you have the option. If you like cell shaded stuff, it's going to cost you a little extra. Um, oh, and now I see a lot of pin covers. And then you have some chrome here and uh, more pin covers. And there are two small chrome here. So, yeah. And what appear to be eyes and I don't know, headlights maybe? We'll see. All right, the final look at gears before the decals. Ah, go ding your diodes and get defunct, Megatron. I'm not helping you do silk. Okay, so we're back from the paint shop, and there's actually enough decals here for another figure. You have, you know, this decal here. Um, we have duplicates here for the shoulders. Uh, extra license plate. Uh, there's a section here uh, where you apply uh, decals here, here 
here, 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 you know, everywhere uh, that for the inside. And that's the interior of, uh, you know, that episode where Megatron opens them up and gets some microchip. A secret sensor scan of all the Autobots reveal that you alone have the special circuit I need. There's enough uh, here, like even that silver decal here, uh, you have here, these here, and uh, on this side, and you have this here. So there's enough for all of that, double. Uh, there's a little nod to the G1 face right here. So, you know, you can, all right, well, technically you could, I don't know, open this up and open this up like that and then have him stand this way, I guess, if you want. Or maybe you can close. Yeah, you can. Well, it doesn't close very well, but I mean, it's an option. Um, uh, there's a, uh, you know, you've noticed the golden grill here. Uh, well, there's an extra one here, silver. And so uh, extra license plate. There's a grill here that will show in uh, alt mode. But there's a grayer one here. This is, uh, I use the uh, blue, metallic blue. And then you have like a couple uh, pin covers and then you have uh, all these decals here are extras for the robot mode and the vehicle mode. So yeah, if 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 I had a second gear, I could potentially, you know, cover the, uh, the other one like at, I don't know, 75%. So anyway, let's take a look at what we have. You have, like I said, the shoulder decals, new eye decals. Uh, I have a leftover for that too. Uh, that grill here, uh, new Autobot logo. If you want, you can have this uh, M here so that it represents uh, more of the uh, G1 toy. Uh, you have crotch decal. There's an extra crotch decal with the Autobot logo. I thought it was a little weird to have him wear his insignia uh, right on his crotch. Uh, chrome legs. That's pretty cool. You have uh, decals here for the, uh, the knee and the toes. Uh, this, the other ones, they show more in alt mode, so we'll save it for that. Uh, that's pretty much for, uh, robot mode. Like I said, all the interior. Oh, you have tons of pin covers too, so, and I just found, uh, the four more reds, and I'm gonna use those, uh, because there's little pins here that I need to cover. Uh, but you have, like, uh, silver, you have blue, you have tons of blue here. I'm actually missing two. That'd be nice. Uh, there's more underneath for the big pins. In the back, you have uh, four reds. Uh, you have, there was more. Uh, oh yeah, underneath here, you have uh, a pin there. Uh, so yeah, I mean, quite a bit of pin coverage. So that's, that's pretty cool. I like that. Pr uh, predictably, nothing for the gun. You know, would have been nice, but uh, you know, it, it's not uh, something that Toy Axe do, does every time. So there you go. So I think for the robot mode, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, and also I still have like all those leftover window decals because I didn't use them at all. Use the uh, cell shaded stuff. So I might put these up for grabs. Um, all right, what else? Pretty much it. All the yeah, pin covers and so there you go. All right, well, let's uh, let's go ahead and put this guy in alt mode. Catch him, but wait for me! Hey, guys! And here we are with the alt mode everybody seems to be complaining about. You know, and beside the wheels being a little soft, uh, you know, they, they tend to bend easily. Um, I love this guy. And it's that's you know that's okay maybe that it's a little weird but I'm not gonna complain I like this guy like the, like this truck nice headlights uh, nice silver the blue uh, kind of shares a color scheme with uh, Defcon um, so yeah no I'm I'm not disappointed with this guy as is but I know that with uh, some decals some windows he's gonna look fantastic so final look at gears before the paint shop. <laughs> I really hate to disappoint you, Starscream, but you better look behind you. Okay, here we are in uh, alt mode. And I don't know what happened, like, um, during transformation, 
this decal here. Oh, and this blue one here. God. Uh, they came unglued, so I'm going to put them back here and fix them when I see where they're going. But I love the new cell shaded look. I uh, They could have been a little uh, thicker, you know, a little wider, I guess. But it looks really good. So a uh, couple options you have for the hood. You could have went with uh, the blue M for a more toy uh, accurate color. And to match the Autobot logo could have replaced this one here. It used to be just gray and then I used that uh, kind of uh, two tone here with the metallic blue. Which I like. It looks really good. Uh, you have the uh, cell shaded sunroof. And you can adjust this one pretty much anywhere you go between this pin and this line because uh, there is no molded details to go around it. Um, you have the... Oh, forgot to close that. Yeah, I have the gears license plate. You have a blue decal to go over those molded details here. Looks really good. New headlights, blue instead of yellow. Uh, the blue metallic blue grill. I uh, really like this one. Uh, but like I said, you have the extra one uh, here, which is more silver. Uh, what else do you have? You have uh, pin covers, pin covers. Uh, you have a decal here. Uh, that's a, uh, you know, pin cover included uh, to go over. Looks real good. Uh, you have these uh, little lights here. Don't look half bad. Um, I guess floodlights and then you have uh, new tail lights and then because of the new kind of grill you have that uh, uh, You know back end kind of looks it's it, it's still a little goofy now to look at this, but everything else looks really good. I Really dig this set this those decals here because there's a little oh, yeah, there's mirror decals on each side but here it was such a pain like to put that little triangle because there's a little um a little slit here between the mirror and the actual window and you have to slide that in there but it keeps gluing as you put it anyway if i done it and i don't it's like whoever gets these uh decals here good luck it was really annoying to uh to you know apply so there you go so that's gears in Alt mode, completely toy axe. I'm really happy with the uh, window option, although you know you have to spend a little extra on it, but it's worth it to me. It is. Um, but I I heard a couple of people complain about the uh, cell shaded stuff, so you know to each his own. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, video. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Also leave a comment. Love reading those. Keep coming back after on the way, and remember. Nothing in life gives you a right to be an asshole. Take care.